welcome to the College of North West London and today we have our annual technology skills competition involving 560 students in 14 different trades, all working at the same time in one building. What's happened is a huge range of competitions right across all our skills, all the skills areas that the college teaches and competitions designed to involve students of all levels to, to really kind of stretch themselves and show what fantastic things they've already learnt and what they're going to be able to take out into the world of work when they've finished. It's the one chance in the year that you get to see all the trades in the Faculty of Technology and they're all happening all in one area. So we have level one in the morning, level two in the afternoon, level three in the evening. We also have outside bodies that come in, look at the work and they can actually judge who's quite good for them to actually go and work for them. So you'll see a lot of employers walking around later on. We have students that have come all the way from Sweden to take part and they're given the chance to take part in the competitions. Well, when you do your bridge, that should um, counteract that anyway. Okay. His boxes were level, one was slightly out. Uh, some of his measurements are not to the actual drawing itself, so that's where you're going to be dropping marks. What these boys are doing is doing the old fashioned method where they're doing a trail flow trail. So this is first year work. The second year work, they're actually doing exactly the same principle, but they're putting moulding. Okay? And the third year is upstairs, they're, what they're actually doing is doing a curved wall, which they've already done, and now they're actually going to do what they used to do back in the early 1920s, actually run in situ. Are you going to make that into a shape? Yeah, it's getting up to a, a well, it's going to be this shape here, with this sort of this here. Oh, right. So it's a, actually a cobbler's. So it's making your own moulding? Yeah. But we've got this, this is the coring out. So the first of all we do this, then we've got to finish it with lime and putty. Right. Which will give the lovely smooth finish after the finish. Top. Yeah. So we're teaching the boys here how to use all the different techniques. From, let's say, from modern classes right the way back to old fashioned classes. Do you want to go into restoration, do you? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm an apprentice already, so I work as a solid plasterer. I work as a solid plasterer, I'll do all the floating and setting and that kind of thing. This, I work the patience for this. <laughs> so, how the marking works is it's broken down out of 100 points. We use organisation, the angle beads, and we use the technique they use. And then they also get marked on tidiness because hopefully they'll be self employed, be doing their own work, so they'll be working in people's houses. This is refrigerant air conditioning, but they're doing the, one of the joining tasks. So when they do install the air conditioning units, they know how to exactly do the mechanical and brazing joints on there. They're going to do some swaging and they're going to do some brazing and then afterwards we're going to do pressure test and see the dimensions and uh, pressure test is holding and then we're going to select who will be the first winner. For me it's an evening course carpentry, so it's twice a week uh, for one year. But I think if you want to carry on, there's about four years uh, you can carry on do. I'm doing level one carpentry and construction skills. I have done um, basic um, carbon last year. Tell me a bit about your apprenticeship. Uh, well, I'll come here every Tuesday. Uh, theory in the mornings and then practical in the evening, uh, in the afternoons. And I've uh, worked for the rest of the week with um, employer. Teachers are excellent, uh, very helpful. And, um, what else? We get uh, to go through a lot of wood, though. That's it. Make many mistakes, but they're very patient. Okay, gentlemen, your time is up now. Well done. 
we could ask you to make sure that you put your name across the top rail so it's nice and neat so we know who they are. And then place them on the bench in the corner. Generally speaking, if somebody does a very good job and doesn't complete everything, they might score quite well against somebody who does not so well on all the little bits but does manage to finish everything because quality of the finish is quite important to us because we're working to professional standards. Right, yeah, first prize under 19 was Nathan. First prize, well done. Well done. And first prize is a £30 tool voucher. Was it a surprise that you won? I was well surprised. I didn't expect to win it. I wasn't even round when they announced it, so I didn't expect to win it. Okay. Right, in the over 19 competition, level one, first prize went to Conrad. Conrad? Well done, Conrad. Well done. Surprise. Well, it was great, great surprise. Uh, well, I didn't actually finish it, uh, so I guess it was based on other stuff. Uh, so that was part of it. I'd seen the other guys work, and that was excellent. So I thought, uh, so that, that's what really shocked me. <laughs> we try and pick a challenging job for each level, and at level two, they're doing a skirting rig, which is quite a professional standard. So one of the things we try and really emphasise is professional hand skills. Yeah, four? Three. Three? Yeah. Okay. Bit of breakage here. Yeah. yeah. So yes. right joint. Um, three. One, three. Two. Two. So this is the level two competition that we have now. Um, we have uh, some adults that are job changers trying to get into the industry and uh, working in building sites at the moment. This competition is testing their pipe bending skills. It's got to be accurate, it's got to look neat, it's got to conform to the drawings that they have there and there's a time element as well. Okay. So these guys will get two hours to complete a, quite a tricky piece of work. The winner gets a nice prize and gets sent forward to the regional competition. We have had some regional and national winners at the college for plumbing. I was, I was gonna go for plumbing, but then I thought bricklaying, give it a go. And now I just enjoy it now. It's a nice job, it's not it's a hard it's hard work, but once you know what to do, it's pretty straightforward really. So, yeah. Well I came down here and I saw what they were doing and you know, I'm pretty good with my hands so I thought alright let me <laughs> let me have a go. Build a basically a garden wall, and then obviously leave half of, half of it empty. Mm -hmm. So you've got like steps, mm -hmm. and you have to do ten courses up, and make sure everything's level and plumb, mm -hmm. and you get your marks. And then see what happens from there. Second place, for the paint and decorating, level one. Goes to a deal, Manmin. Well done, Thank you very much. First place goes to Georgie Spicer. Well done, mate. Okay. Well done.
Uh, absolutely well done. Now this year we've got a wonderful new sponsor from Rose Trails. Dave, thanks very much for coming up. We've also got our principal here who's going to be giving out the uh, prizes. So, John? So in second place is Oliver. That. Yeah. Oliver Lyndon Lemon. He's not here either. No, he's, <laughs> right he's here. Right here. Right here. Right here. So that's Oliver. Oliver, take the prize there now. Yes, One yes. of those. The first prize, uh, just gonna, before I announce it, the quality of work was absolutely excellent. It's the best one I've seen in the four years, was uh, Leandro. So well done, Leandro. Well done. Oh, yes. That's the So if I move on to the second years, and in second place, it's a very close between first and second place, is uh, Damon. Damon <laughs> Absolutely well done. That's in four years now. Yeah, so that's yeah. in four so years. Credit so. to you guys, actually. And that's been commented on by people from industry and other parts of the college, so absolutely. The leather's lovely as well. Thanks, thanks guys for coming. Oh, 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 Thank you.